there, ladies and gentlemen, welcome, welcome, welcome back to another Wednesday, which means it's time to put Konosuba to bed. And which means we will never see any Konosuba ever again. Unless the movie does really well. Please let the movie do really well, for God's sake. Everybody except the only character that mattered got an arc. Please. <laughs> So in the last episode, Aqua continued her arc, and the arc is her being the worst person possible. Being so bad that she gets her own god damn fucking believer base mad at her thinking that she's a goddamn demon. Aqua, maybe if your fucking blessing upon joining the church wasn't an immediate drop of about 50 brain cells, maybe you know we wouldn't be in this situation. Oh, sorry. 500 brain cells. Maybe the fucking communion wine shouldn't have been replaced with Clorox in order to fucking uh, save on costs. Oh, Jesus. But yeah, now everybody in Aqua's hometown wants. Uh, sorry, in Aqua's base of operations for her religion wants her fucking dead. Oh boy, I wonder how we're gonna get out of this. And I wonder if it's going to make Aqua. Get, go anywhere near the amount of prestige I had for her at the start of the show. Probably not. Oh boy. Oh, jeez. Could we just get the movie to come out? And then get, like, season three? And then, like, all the rest of the seasons? Like, like all the way? Like, I need, like, more shows that, like, have Dragon Ball-level longevity, but without the fucking Dragon Ball Super problem, you know? Like, how many episodes was Dragon Ball Z? It was a lot. <laughs> you know? I don't know. I, we, we need more of that. Like, I kind of miss that from the 90s. But, hey, here's... But let's finish off Konosuba Season 2 with a bang, shall we? In 3, 2, 1, and go! CG protesting torches. Scree! Oh, they don't deal with it at all. They don't deal with it at all. She just flies away. But you're the one who... But you're the one who ruined the hot springs by turning them into water, you idiot. Like, you were flying away. Could you not have just left the village and burned it down? Aqua, you can get more followers, for fuck's sake. Wait, she's... She's finally showing people her fucking adventurer card. The adventurer card says God on it. it you can't forge that. Why not just show the fucking... Wait, what? How the fuck is the Eris faith... You know, it makes sense. The Axis faith can't be fucking trusted with their own goddamn water source. I wouldn't say lizard, I'd say maybe like an anole? Then why are you helping them? Why are you guarding... Why are you guarding the fucking... The fucking water source, then? Hey, Darkness, how about you fucking kill those men? Oh my god. Dark Darkness, why are you resisting? Why is she resisting? That Eris pendant is going to be the thing that gets them, like... Does Darkness just secretly want this Axis fucking cult to burn down?
No, it super does, though. It super does, though. Oh, she's pouting. I treat you like a piece of shit because you're my friend. Only friends treat people like- Only friends treat friends like pieces of shit. The easiest member of the party in many- in more ways than one. Wait, what? <laughs> So, it, wait, is that perhaps the reason why the cultists are so fucking stupid? Because they've just been bathing in literal po- Oh, hey, it's Soap Man. What are you doing, Soap Man? He's got poison touch. He's got a, he's got the opposite of purify. He's got poison touch, doesn't he? He's another lieutenant. He's another fucking lieutenant. God damn it. Oh, Wiz, you f- Wiz is too pure. She needs to stop. She needs to stop. She's so pure that she might just start purifying herself in a second. Just evaporating. You're not getting anywhere without sexually harassing our paladin first! Yes, she- <laughs> Fucking really? Like, okay, so he's he doing this because- is he doing this out of spite, or is he doing it because he was told to? Wait, that was the deal? Okay, so what the fuck was Wiz's actual deal with, with the Demon King thing? Like, so like, basically she just became a bystander kind of thing? She's like, you know, I don't want to fight you, but I don't want to go, like, do evil shit either. That's kind of... That's, I mean, that's kind of, like, worse, Wiz. Holy shit. Wait, what? I would... I would really like to know what Wiz's fucking backstory is. Oh, look out! He's got a butter knife! Oh, no! You have slain one thing. You have slain one thing, Kazuma. So why did Kazuma suddenly grow his testicles? Is he trying to show off for his waifu right now? Like, seriously, why- Oh, it's because he thinks he can't lose. He's acting like he's got a big dick because he can't lose. Or he thinks he can't. 
Deadly Poison Shrahim! And now that he's learned... Now that he's learned, Cosma immediately loses his dick. Slimes are the worst thing ever, and they're the stars of the worst possible anime! Yeah, Cosby, you really didn't think this through, did you? Thanks for telling him, Aqua, you stupid idiot! Nice one, Kazuma. So, question. They've got- They've got the equivalent of three nuclear bombs and a fucking- And a fucking- And, and a fucking bunker with them. I am pretty sure- I am pretty sure Darkness could tank that. And between Megumin and Wiz, they could probably take the fucker down. Touching the thing wouldn't even be necessary. Oh no, she got upset and ran away. We kind of need Aqua alive, otherwise you need to look for another healer, and who the fuck's gonna join the party? Really? You're going to defeat him by insulting his love life? Like, you're gonna defeat him by insulting his love life. Alright, Aqua, let's see how that works for you. So... So why couldn't they just wait for him to be done and then have Aqua just purify it after the fact? Like, I mean, it, yeah. Oh, Wiz is upset. <laughs> Wiz is upset. You fool. You broke the byline of the third paragraph of section two of the treaty. Now I get to murder the shit out of you. Wait, wait, she was the ice witch? Alright. Wiz, you probably should have froze the whole thing, not just, like, you know, his arm. So, hey, Wiz, you're undead, right? Poison heals you. Go on, you can... It's fucking might have done. Aqua, you stupid idiot! Oh, that does not look- that does not look good on her hands, holy shit! It can wait five minutes! Holy shit! It can w oh god, they're all dead. Oh, they are all dead.
Okay, hang on. So can she actually... Okay, so Doctor just can't tank that. Otherwise, she would have just done it. No, Megaman, that's stupid. Don't do it. We keep really, they keep running into things that were just like, Mega Man could blow it up, but it would just make the situation worse. It's fucking stupid, man. Okay. The soap. The soap. Oh no, the detergent! The detergent, shit! They thought of the detergent. He hated the detergent, right? There you go. That's the fucking. Oh, it's the dead. It's the dead fucking overseer. There he is. Wait, but. What? Oh, it, thankfully it's exactly half. Oh, she's so happy. She's so happy. This is my favorite part of any of any anime. Just like when the fucking main the main theme starts playing, you know shit's going down. So, like the soap, the soap annoys him. He doesn't like the 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 the, the, the detergent. Like, you think Kaza would have tried throwing the detergent at him? Yet yeah, you would have thought. Megaman's just getting hyped. Megaman's just- Megaman don't even care what's going on. She's like, I get to blow up the big man! Uh... Fucking... I can't believe Kazuma is fucking dead. Every single time they have to fucking stop one of, like something on this fucking scale. Kazuma just has to fuck god damn. Man, it's a good thing death has no fucking meaning anymore. Oh, so she can tank it. It just takes her a bit. I do want to know more about like what Wiz was like before she became a lich. Like, for real, like... Like, yeah, it's for real, like, it's- I'm actually curious. Cause she seems like- like, now that the fucking sad little shopkeeper thing has fallen away and she's like, Oh no! Like, all timid. Now she's actually just like, she's in there. Like, it's actually super fucking hype. Like, what was she like before she became undead? Like, for, like, I, I hope not every fucking fight in Konosuba is just... He's a squid kid. He's a kid now, he's a squid now. Ah, uh, now Aqua's been supercharged because she's got her hype men going on. You could have just overdubbed that with Falcon Punch, it'd be the same fucking thing. That's just a fucking Falcon Punch! Believe harder, you cowards!
Oh my god. It's society's fault if you fuck up. Aqua's fucking cult is the cult of sh lazy, shiftless assholes. Are you fu- oh my god. I mean, I assumed! I guess- oh look, she's making a Rasengan! Tailed Beast Bomb! Bleh. Repent, motherfucker! <laughs> Just fucking Falcon Punchin', alright! Didn't think I'd see fucking Aqua doing goddamn falcon punches, but alright then. I'm down. Kono Dio da. Oh, Jesus. Alright, okay. Seriously, I hope, like, not everything is just, oh yeah, Cosma dies to get the guy in position. Because, come on, Cosma, act, do something fucking useful for a second. Wow. Wow, Aqua, even when you try and win, you fuck up. Seriously, Aqua, for real, you had literally one fucking job. You had one fucking job. Aw, oh, Wiz is so sleepy. And transparent. Seriously, I fucking... Mmm. I can't believe how absolutely fucking useless Aqua is. Even when Aqua has her moment of be being a fucking badass motherfucker. She still fucks up. I... Oh. She had her moment. Yen Yen! Yen Yen! It's not like I want to finish our rivalry or anything, b b b baka uh. I can... Uh. Like, I... Mmm... <sighs> oh no, we forgot to pay our water bill. Oh no. Thanks for your pl- A winner is you! Oh jeez, is there, is there going to be anything at the end? I don't know, okay. Oh boy, Sakana Soup. I gotta do like the whole series now, don't I? Uh, as far as, like, a review goes. Okay, so I'll start with this episode, right? And then I'll just go into the ep the series as a whole. Um, so I will say that this episode and the episode that preceded it, because it's basically just one big episode, isn't it? But it's probably the weakest of the entire series, you know? Like, I just don't... Yeah, I just... I just... You got that big hype bit at the end where they're beating up Hansi put the deadly slime. Like you, you got that at the end, and it's just yeah, it's kind of neat. It's kind of neat, but at the same time, the <sighs> like you know, it's it's neat for about ten seconds, and ten seconds out of forty minutes. It's a really low level of being awesome, you know, like... 
And I and I was hoping that like the fact that he doesn't like the detergent was gonna come in, and the way they shrink him down was convince the Axis cult, the Axis cult, to start throwing detergent at him instead of the soap. He didn't be able to take the. And it just cuts off before he could say fight before he could finish the word begun. Oh boy. Um. Oh boy. Okay, but um. Where was I? Yeah. So like it just. It just like the, the 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 they felt I felt like they set up a method of defeating him, like maybe make it so that the detergent fucks him up a bit, maybe like cause him to lose mass or like it di dissolves him or something like that. I thought that was where they were going, because that's you know where the foreshadowing was going. But no, the foreshadowing was Megamin blow him up. Oh no, he's gonna pollute the whole mountain. Oh wait, there's a base in there. Kazuma tricks him into going in. Dies and then Megumin blows him up and then Aqua does a fucking falcon punch. <sighs> okay, then I guess. Fucking, <laughs> uh, like I, like the falcon punch was hype as fuck. Like seeing Wiz go serious mode, hype as fuck. Like Kazuma actually having some quick thinking, hype as fuck. But everything leading up to it was just. <sighs> You know, just not great, not great. But at the same time, it's the arc of Aqua, and basically Aqua's entire character is not great. So I guess it kind of fits. Like, it does feel like probably like a, a really weak send off to a really good show because I, I don't because they're getting a movie coming up this this summer season, I think it is. And by the way, we're gonna be doing a video on that. So, oh boy, look forward to that. I don't know when it's gonna when it's gonna happen, cause you know I gotta get the subtitles and all that shit. But it's gonna happen. Oh boy. Um, and I hope that that movie does really, really well, because I'm hoping if the movie does well, we get season three. Because I feel like we we can't we can't fucking leave it on that. We cannot leave it leave this show on this last two episodes. We fucking can't. It, ah, ugh. Like, compare it to the, um, big fucking ant fight, the giant fuck-off ant from the end of season one. That was hype all the way through. You had this entire thing was like, oh god, we're at the whole entire city's gonna fucking die, oh shit! And, like, it's just quick thinking and, like, exploring and just, like, like, the twist at the end being like, yeah, I made this giant robot! I don't know how to fucking turn it off! I'm having a rough day, not gonna lie! Like, you know, like, just kind of, like, the twist, like... Like, what was the twist here? Like, the the twist was that Wiz is secretly a badass? Like, it's not really that much of a twist. We kind of just assumed that because she's a, she's a Devil King lieutenant, but yet she somehow has gotten out of fighting. That you have to be a pretty big badass for fucking, like, the Demon King to be like, Oh, you fight, okay, you could be a lieutenant. You don't want to fight, okay. Don't want to fight no one. Fine, just be on my side and just don't fucking hurt anyone, please, for the love of God. Like, we kind of assumed that. Like, Wiz being a giant badass, like, I, I thought that was granted. That's, that's not really, that's not really, like, a twist, you know? Like, and the, and the subversion and the twisting, like, that's kind of what I expected. This was just kind of basic bitch anime power of friendship, you know? Like, Aqua gets her cult on her on her side, and they give her a bunch of belief, so she fucking murders the big bad with the power of friendship and blind faith in a fucking deity. And then at the end, like, oh no, by using it, she used her divine powers, granted by those motherfuckers, to, and accidentally purified the entirety of the thing, which means the bad guys won anyway. Like... I get it. It's Aqua. We're supposed to laugh when she gets hurt, but at the same time... <sighs> Aqua doesn't deserve it. And Aqua's a cunt, but she's a cunt who's kind... She's a cunt more or less because she's been forced into a situation that's really above... Like, basically, it's above her pay... It's, it's, right, it's below her pay grade. She doesn't... She's supposed to be sorting the fucking living from the dead in on Earth. Like, she doesn't need to be here. The only reason she's here is because some chuckle fuck thought he'd get one over on the fucking... Reincarnation system. Like. Yeah, like. Aqua's a piece of shit. 
I really don't like her because as time's gone on, she's gotten relatively, like, relative to everyone else, she's gotten worse. Despite the fact that her character hasn't actually changed all that much from this first episode, because it doesn't really have to. Like, Aqua's a character, like, sorry, Aqua's not a character, she's a fucking plot device. And making an arc based around your plot device is not great. You know, it just, I don't know, it just, I feel like it just, this, this, this arc at the end here just not... Yeah, especially after the fucking hilarious shit that was Darkness's arc, you know, uh, and and the whole thing that was just basically Kazuma's arc in the first in the first season, you know, I was like, yeah, it's not it's not great, not great. And I just really feel like it's not a good send off to the show, you know. Um, yeah, fucking like, I mean, visuals were good. Like, I like the idea of fucking like Aqua getting enough faith to do a Falcon punch. That's dank as fuck, but. Beyond that, like, this was just... Th this whole, like, these past two episodes just felt like an overextended joke. Just overextended joke. Overextended joke leading into a semi-decent boss fight. But a boss fight that's basically done paint by the numbers, like, fucking... Like, the like the author of Fakes basically like, Oh, fuck, I need, like, to do, like, two more chapters. Uh, uh, I need to finish off Aqua's arc. Oh, fuck. Why did I decide to make an arc about a fucking plot device? Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, hang on. I've got... Uh, hang on, I've got to call you a shonen jump here. All right. There's a Mad Libs thing at the end for making a shonen anime plot. All right, yeah, I'll just punt, punch fucking adjectives and shit in here. And All right, so noun for a monster. Uh, slime. Adjective to describe the monster. Deadly. Uh... Then... The enemy is defeated by the power of abstract, abstract thing. Belief. You know, like, you know, it feels like a very paint-by-numbers Mad Lib shown an anime ending. And just, I just don't, I'm just not a big fan of it, really. I'm just not really big, like, I love Konosuba. I love Megumin. I love Darkness. I love Kazuma. Fucking, I can tolerate Aqua's existence. And Wiz is f fucking great. But just... I don't know, I, but I just, I just did not like this, this this last arc here. I just did not like it. But overall, the show is still really, really good. I fucking love Konosuba. Um, cannot wait until the fucking movie comes out. And I'm hoping that movie does good enough to... I just fucking smashed my desk with my hand. Ow. <laughs> I hope... <clears throat> I hope the movie does well enough that we get a season three. Because I need more of it. Just inject it into my fucking veins. Because like I said before, like fucking... Anime nowadays, it's like, you get to the end of, like, whatever, like, the two or three seasons you get, and it's like, Go read the light novel! F ooh, fuck, ooh, fuck, what was that? Go read the light novel, fucker! Bang, bang! Bang, bang, bang! We're not adapting this no more! Because short attention span! Bang, bang! Like, remember back in fucking, like, the 90s and early 2000s, where if, like, an a, a, a manga or a fucking novel... What? Not really, not really. The novels aren't really adapted, but it's mostly just manga. But when a manga came out and it was really fucking popular, they'd adapt the whole fucking thing. Like, we need... I, I want more of that. I want more of that. I want fucking... Like, and, and... But specifically, I want it done on the good shit. So, like, fucking do it for Overlord. Do it for Konosuba. Fucking... Do it for fucking, um... I, I hate the anime for My Hero Academia, but I love Hero Academia, and if the anime gets more people into the manga, then fuck it, that's good. Fucking give me fucking f full Hero Academia, just do the whole fucking thing. Uh, fucking One Punch Man. Just like, all these fucking, uh, comics and, uh, uh, manga and novels that are coming out, fucking, if you're gonna adapt them, adapt the whole fucking thing. Like... Because it's like, we've got this weird thing where just like, you've got like, things like One Piece, Dragon Ball, um, you know, shit that's like, been like, legacy content almost, that's being adapted like, the entire way through, and just like, and it just feels like holdovers, and it's like, I feel like we do, we need more anime that's like that, anime that just keeps on going, especially if you've got something like, 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 Konosuba apparently, like, I don't know a whole bunch, but apparently in Konosuba they've even, like, they've, that they're nowhere near done, from what I can, from what I've been told, and they've got a lot of stuff going on, including fucking, like, characters, like, not growing up, but, like, maturing, you know? And I want to see that, because you don't get to see that nearly often enough. The closest we've seen recently to that 
is fucking Dragon Ball. And Dragon Ball is the is the fucking king of keeping their fucking characters childish. You know? Like seeing Gohan grow up from little tiny baby in a fucking pod to adult with adult with a fucking job. Yeah, but who fucking moonlights as a superhero or a super sentai hero. Like that's the closest we fucking got. And we need more of that in, in shows. We need more of that. We need characters growing up. We need that. But yeah, that's, that's really what I think. Let me know what you think down there in the comments. Whether you agree with me, disagree with me, or you're going to bring up something I omitted because that probably happened. But I tried to go over as much as I could think of at the time. And yeah. Uh, let me know if you're excited for the Konosuba movie. Oh, boy. And uh, also uh, Konosuba season three. Because, oh, boy, please. Please. For the love of God. Fucking who, who makes this? Is it Katakawa? Fucking, it is Katakawa, right? I think it's Katakawa. I mean, if it is Katakawa, they better not do what they fucking did to Overlord Season 3 and fucking make everything goddamn shitty-ass PlayStation 2 Atari 2600 CG. But, yeah. Like, I don't actually, I'm trying to find who made this, and I don't actually know. Um, I'm not seeing Katakawa's name. But also, I don't read Moon Runes. Madbox. Alright, well. Whatever company makes this anime, fucking... Oh, it is Katakawa. Whatever, whatever, like, fucking Katakawa, fucking season three, gimme gimme, but don't fucking put that shit-ass Atari 2600 shit in it. You pieces of shit. Yeah. Anyway, as always, I am Mods of to like, comment, favorite, subscribe, share social media, tell your friends, and, uh, if you want to support the channel monetarily, then hey. Well, you can always support me on Patreon, link down in the description, get your extra special patrons only Discord channel on the open Discord server, which is also linked down there, and down there you can rec and there you can recommend things to be let's played, reacted to, live streamed, whatever. And also we've got our special patrons only movie night happening mm, happening uh still happening on in February. It's only gonna be like round about the I wanna say probably the Probably like the 23rd or 24th, probably. I still need to run it by the patrons. Um, I've just been like really busy this month. So I haven't really had time. Usually we have it like around the 12th. Um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. We just hang out, watch some animes, play some video games, and just kind of have a fun old grand old time. Anyway. Uh, oh yeah, and also hit that share button. Like, if you're hitting that like button, hit that share button. Share it on the Twitter or the Facebook or the whatever the fuck you got. Tell your friends. Arm yourselves with knowledge. Because uh, YouTube basically removed that from my end, so I can't fucking do it, so... Yeah. Anyway, as always, you in the next video. Boys and will become a trash mammal today, and I'll see you a round